My project is around 3D printing bespoke breast prosthesis for women post mastectomy for their prosthesis that they can wear then for the rest of their life. We're working with Breakthrough Cancer Research to basically meet unmet needs of these cancer patients that are post diagnosis and post surgery. So this will be a perfect fit um, for each individual woman. So everyone with every different breast shape, size can have their own perfect custom fit to them to enhance their quality of life for the rest of their life. In the first scan, you have the scan of the mastectomy site. So we're getting all the different contours. And as you can see in the video, it's very simple. She's just standing there with her hands on her hips and we get her to do that for both scans so we can measure up with the shoulders to make sure we have it perfectly aligned. And then the second scan then is of the remaining breast and we do it in the bra. So that's the shape it will take in the other side when it's in a bra. The Confirm Centre for Smart Manufacturing is an SFI funded centre headquartered out of the University of Limerick but with partners from right across other third level institutes in Ireland. It brings together expertise in manufacturing technologies and looking at the future in terms of how technologies can enhance life and product manufacture etc. The Rapid Innovation Unit is based in the Confirm Centre and we're looking at how smart technologies of the future can be used to make and produce novel healthcare solutions uh, for treating patients. Part of our long-term vision is looking at how these new technologies can be deployed within healthcare settings and ultimately to improve clinical care and the quality of life of patients. We have all of the different printers because they all do a subtly different job at a subtly different price point, be it machine or material or speed, which is essentially um, one of our currencies here is when we're rapidly Doing a project, if it's going to take 15 hours to print, you're setting yourself back. So the job dictates the machine you use. So at the Rapid Innovation Unit, we work directly with patients and clinicians at the point of care. So on the ground in the hospital, working directly to identify unmet clinical needs. We do that by putting patient quality of life as a focus and working directly with the user. Typically, we take those needs and we bring them back to the Confirm Research Centre here and we develop a design solution using 3D modeling software and our suite of 3D printers to develop a solution. So hopefully we're able to turn around a quick solution the majority of the time using the technology and the expertise we have here in the Rapid Innovation Unit. So we've been working with our patient to get the different user needs and requirements that she feels that you would need from this uh, breast prosthetic and we are hoping to open it up to a wider study so that we can talk to many patients about the current prosthesis that they have and that they wear or that they don't wear to then find out what they would love from a bespoke prosthesis fitted to them in order to produce the perfect custom prosthesis for everyone.